Today we'll be looking at the characteristic function of the daily distribution. The probability mass function of the daily distribution is MNS. <coughs> so L of x, and this is P of x is equal to summation x from, from 0 to 1. Probability of P raised to power x divided by Q raised to power 1 minus x. In daily distribution, x can only assume the value of 0 or 1 like this. x can be 0 or 1. We cannot take more than 1. Then we have P to be the probability of uh, sources and Q the probability of failure of image. Q is equal to 1 minus P. And the characteristic function, characteristic function is given as um, exponential i of t x. Now, this is the probability mass function of the new distribution, and this is the characteristic function. Now, we now want to look for the characteristic function of this new distribution. It means we're using this and this, and therefore we need to have phi x of t equals to summation x one from 0 to 1 exponential i of t x multiplied by the probability of the Newman distribution into this and as such this is going to be equals to summation x one from 0 to 1 exponential I of t x multiply by the probability mass function of the limit, which is a q raised to power x, q raised to power 1 minus x. And here this is going to give us, here we have raised to power x, raised to power x. We can join these two together and make everything to the raised to power x. And as such, we need to have summation x1 from 0 to 1, probability exponential. I of t, I of t, everything raised to power x, k raised to power 1 minus x. And we should not forget that our s can only assume the value of 0 or 1. It cannot be more than 1. And substituting this 0 and 1 into this equation, which is summation, so we're going to have 5 x of t equals to probability exponential i to t raised to the power when x is 0 now. 0 q raised to the power 1 minus 0 plus when x is 1 we have um, p exponential i to t raised to the power 1 then we have uh, q raised to the power instead of uh, one here we have instead of one, one minus and our x is at one. We have one minus one. Now if you look at this, if the n raised to power zero equals one, therefore this is going to be q raised to power one plus here it is going to be zero. One minus one is zero. So this one also we have p exponential i of t. So this is the probability um this is a uh, characteristic function of the image distribution. And we should not forget that our q is the same thing as 1 minus p. Therefore, we can also write it as phi x of t equals to 1 minus p plus p exponential i of t. We can also write it this way. And this is the characteristic function of the image distribution.